Hey guys, Brad from Circling a Drone here. I just wanted to uh, do a quick video. There is a new update as of this morning for the uh, Hubson Xeno Pro. Um, if you go to support on the hubson.com website, and you'll see firmware. Hit firmware, and then you see down here it's downloading Xeno Pro 1214. So that's today's date. Uh, brand new firmware. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and cancel that because I already already downloaded it. I'll go to my Xeno Pro firmware. You see I have three different folders here. I've, there's been three updates since the Xeno Pros come out. Um, I haven't updated any of them yet, but I'm going to go ahead and do this. This is a pretty big one. It's got uh, some new features. So if we go to Xeno Pro change log, You can see the uh, new firmware is 1.0.15 for the flight controller, 3.029 for the firmware gimbal, and uh, for the camera, 0 0.2.4. <clears throat> and uh, you can see down here what they change, added delay photography, uh, added panoramic photos, uh, added voice prompt of aircraft status, Added shutter speed adjustment, uh, open GPS follow, optimized, in, optimized intelligent image following, uh, added the countdown of low power return, and added the countdown of serious low power slowdown. Okay, so let me go into the app here and I'll show you what my firmwares are as of right now. Uh, my camera firmware is at 0 0.15 and the new one is 0 0.24 0 0.2.4 uh, let's see the flight controller firmware on mine is 1.7 the new one is 1.0.15 all right and let's see the gimbal firmware on mine is 3.0 0.26 and the new firmware is 3.0.2.9 and uh, to update the firmware in this it's uh, the same as the old <coughs> the old Xeno the original Xeno you have to use the um, Xeno Pro upgrade tool and this is version 1.2 So you have to use a USB cable for the uh, flight controller and for the uh, gimbal. And then for the uh, camera firmware you have to use a formatted SD card and you put these two files on there. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. Alright so I finished the update, uh, we go into the app here. Uh, check the uh, versions. You can see the camera version is now up to point zero point two point four, and the gimbal is updated. And the uh, flight control is updated to the uh, new air, uh, firmware version that was just released this morning. So um, I'm going to take this outside. It's raining right now, so I'm not going to fly, but I'm going to um, just uh, so I can, when I get GPS, I can. Oh, here we go. I got GPS now. So let's go into create a video. Oh, I have to take off. Shoot. Well, I guess I'm going to have to wait until it gets nice because it won't show me any of the, uh, all right, so I'm going to have to wait till it quits raining and, uh, we can 
check out these new uh, features.